All right, let's get the AFC started. It's the AFC East. Skimbo and Ice starts right now. And Ice, Ooh. little spin move already. Oh, he's getting next and early. And takes this out to good fill position, and that's where the youngster will start. And Ice doesn't look nervous. Rodgers can't get away from the pressure. Second and 22. Yeah, there they go. But throws it downfield and it's picked off. That's Mel Renfro. And Skimbo has the ball already at the 31. And there goes Carson Wentz. He'll be near the marker. Have him just shy. These youngsters like to spit bars, but we have yet to see a champ that Really likes to spit those rhymes. I think it's a nervous tick. Better fired up, but you're right. Usually the, the champions, the guys that make the deepest runs, they're calm, cool, and collected because they're just so focused at the task at hand. Don't let me interrupt Ice's rapping. What they give you the play by oh play. And Cooks is into the end zone. And look at the savagery of Skimbo. That's just business as usual. He doesn't even blink. He doesn't get excited. He's still focused at the task at hand. And if you're iced, you need to realize you are dealing with a monster. If you make the, the champ, oh, Ice getting dotty. If you make the championship of this club series, nothing you'd rather do than go watch his team play in that Super Bowl live and in person. And his buddy Dubby's a big Eagles fan, so. There's your two tickets. And imagine that for the Patriots organization. If you're able to just clean sweep the Super Bowl <laughs> and the Madden Club Championship, swag on 100 trillion. Second and nine from the 45 for Ice. Trailing by a touchdown. Goes back to Kittle. And Paul Krause says hello. And that looping linebacker blitz. Third and four. Screen. And another sack to set up a key situation that no major org has gone out and got this guy Michael Skimbo yet. If I am into eSports and I'm, you know, a recruiter for those organizations, this is the guy that I'm going after. 91 seconds to go in the first. Skimbo up by a touchdown with the ball. Wentz buying time and he'll throw it away. He feels like it's a true threat in this tournament. And when you look at Blocky's record online, he was 94 and 6, so. A legitimate threat right there. Good D by Ice. Another throwaway. Throw it at me, please. Ha! Third and ten now on the 48. Wentz to Cooks, and that's an easy first down for Skimbo and the Pats. So first and ten now. Has Cooks again, boy. Brendan Cooks has been absolutely magical here in this first quarter. It's just an animal, man. Skimble also a great role model for some of these younger players. Well, this is the only deficit we saw in his offense. Jamal Charles as his running back. If you're new to Madden watching us or if you're here in the crowd here in Orlando, they're playing salary cap mode. So it's all about drafting your players and, and, and assembling your team, but you got to stay under a certain cap. Yeah, that's As Skimbo makes it 14 to nothing. Somewhat of a disadvantage, but oh, he ice. is able. Ice is getting icy. That's a 30. That's a spin move. Oh, 20. Icy. 10. Die. And they take him down at the one. Let's go. Oh, Ice is failing it. The young buck just had Skimbo on skates in the open field down at the one. Can he punch it in? Skim's not happy. High formation now after the big return. And he tries to sneak it in and no. And the, the problem is it, you're going up against your regular buddy at home, getting this one yards, no big deal. But he gets a player like Mike Stop. Skim, it's tough, but I still don't care. Stop. He don't care about ice and he don't care about skim either. The first time in the history of Madden, someone's called a QB sneak dot. It's a run dot. <laughs> 14 to seven now.
Throws it late, but Grant able to pick up a quick 14. Still wrapping off three plays. Kim said it. He's going to go deep. Aaron Rodgers impression right here. And throws across his body to Grant. And that's going to move it all the way down to the 23 after the decline penalty. Just taking more pressure off of him. There's another jump. Another free one. Another free one. This time he will throw it to X, oh. and it's a touchdown! It's going to be 21 to 7. After the long run by Ice, Skimbo comes back to answer. Now back to the ground for Ice, but this time Skimbo's got it bottled up. Off the back foot, that's Deion oh, Sanders. In prime time. I can't stop you, but die. <laughs> He's old character, isn't he? So, yo, I can't stop you, but dot. Oh, Skim almost marked that. So they're all in on their guy, but dot. finds Moss down at the seven-yard line. Thirty-four on the ladder. So Ice's record's no joke. And Rogers can't get rid of it. Say by the bell was tough too. Oh, and Ice, Ice is getting in there. Die, die, die. Die. Ah. Ah. Man, man. Do something stupid, please. <laughs> I. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh. He asks Skimbo to please do something stupid and then proceeds to mix the extra <laughs> point. Sad tuba. Oh, uh, life could be rough sometimes. 21 to 13. Oh, no. He doesn't seem discouraged, though. Skimbo, no timeouts here. 40 seconds to go before the half. Bud Dupree. Good. Commissioner might get up there, give him a language warning or something. I'll text my mom and tell her to tune in later in the broadcast. Oh my God. As Johnson able to pull it in on the sideline. No timeouts. That's going to stop Skim. the clock, though. Yeah, he needed it. Skim's got no timeouts. Ice will not go away. That's very apparent. Ice isn't here to lay down. That, that confidence is very real that he has. 21 to 13. He's going to get tackled in bounds. He's going to have to hustle up to the line. It's a 51 yarder from there. And, watch him and he's got Greg the leg as his kicker. And watch him get this field goal off. Only need about six or seven seconds. He's got nine. Oh my gosh. I think he's. Is up and it is good. And that's why he's the champ. You miss an extra point, he comes back and gets three. That's a four-point swing. And I think the thing you need to realize is it's, it's so hard to play offense in Madden 18, and I don't think Skimbo was close to getting stopped there in the first half. He got points every time he touched the ball, Coltrane. So first and ten now. But, you know, he's representing the, the Patriots and Michael Skimbo. But that's what they do so well. They get a little score before the half, and then on this opening drive, that's where they really open it up. I'm telling you, I don't think. Oh, oh that's picked up! God, yes, what was it? Let's go. Let's go. That's Leonard Williams. Oh on my the line. goodness! Look at Skim's face. Says it all. First and ten. For Ice can't get rid of it. And that, you know what? Props to Ice. When you stay confident, you don't get down in the dumps. And just can't hold on. Try to force it in between two defenders. Throws it to B, and there's Sanders. And he's saying that's as good as a punt. He's even happy he throws an interception. He, he's always willing to make a positive out of it, huh? 
And there is Jamal Charles, the former Longhorn, will take it to the 20 yard line. And this is where Skimbo's game to me has always been at it. This is the worst situation for him. Well, it's a good situation because he's up, but it's hard for him to kill the clock and run the ball because he's just so heavy on that passing attack. His run game's never been very world class. Wentz finds Grant. Third quarter, three minutes ago. Third and two for Skimbo. He's going to. Wow. Under pressure. Skimbo has never really changed this offense. His region is just so surgical. Look at this. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. No need. He's not worried about running the ball. He's not worried about killing the clock. He just continues to walk upfield. So it's truly a special talent. Wentz rolling. Finds Jamal Ooh, Charles. You got to be careful with that sort of hit. You got to think Skimbo most likely with Jamal Charles, and you haven't really seen him attempt any moves. I wouldn't be surprised if he has his ball carrier on conservative the entire game. He's not trying to risk a fumble. Those are coach, coaching adjustments you can make pre-snap. And Bud Dupree comes through again. And there's Delaney Walker right there at the nine, and that's fourth and two. He's going to try to fake snap. He's going to fake snap, try to draw the defense off sides, hoping Ice isn't aggressive. And if he doesn't jump off sides, he'll take the delay of game and then kick the field goal. Double tight end up under center. Here comes the fake snap. There it is. There's the fake snap. No off sides. Take the delay. It's a 31 yarder for Skimbo. So smart. <laughs> and ice down 14. Mama Ice got to be in the crowd rooting him on. This is his chance to come back. And word on the street is Dubby's here rooting on Skimbo. But he's rooting him on with a Patriots jersey on. Yeah. And Dubby relying on Skimbo to secure these tickets so they can go watch the teams play in the Super Bowl. Ice. How many sacks Skimbo has, huh? This blitz is screaming. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Taking shots on ice over there. <laughs> There's a sack all the way back at the two-yard line. This is, this is gonna get dark. This is gonna get dark. <laughs> <laughs> He's trying to hold back the <laughs> smart. Third and 33. <laughs> Put your fours up. We're in the fourth quarter. Oh, you gotta love fight skim. Here between the Jets and the Patriots. It's a big play though. I mean, down 14. Heisken somehow. Finds Moss. Here's the motion. Rodgers. Somehow escapes and throws oh! it downfield and picked off. Sam Shields. First and ten now for Skimbo. He's, just, he's so surgical. He's just so surgical, man. And Brendan Cooks has been the story. And a score here would make it very tough on ice as Cooks finally drops one. Mike's the real deal. Even in the practice game, Skim's just out there. He, he's really just doesn't take any days off. Every game he plays, he's out there trying to win. And Got to be careful. Ooh, low throw. Well, that's going to pretty much put this one in the fridge, RG. Here in the AFC East between the Jets and the Pats. And it was a pretty exciting game for all the viewers out there because there was some capping going on. Like, what's your thoughts on that? Nah, Skimbo's just a great guy, great competitor. Had to say some stuff to get in his head, you know. Did it work? No, I mean, I hear it all. I mean, it was just funny. I told him, enjoy the experience. It may never happen again for you. So that was about it.